Good afternoon, everyone. I'm uh, Rennie Grills. I'm Miwasan Valley Authority's Resource Management Officer. And right behind you, or right behind me, is a prescribed burn that we conducted today with multiple partners to uh, restore the, and enhance the ecological significance of the Northeast Swale. Prescribed burning uh, can be used for multiple uh, objectives and so for this uh, burn we set uh, three objectives. One objective was to remove invasive grasses as part of the restoration process for the site. Uh, number two was to enhance wildlife habitat on the site so increasing biodiversity and structural diversity for grassland songbirds. And then three, since this site uh, is adjacent to the Mimawasan Trail here at the Northeast Swale, uh, we want to reduce the fire risk uh, to the surrounding neighbourhoods around the site by adding fire, reducing that uh, uh, growth and that old grass growth. And by adding the fire, we reduce that fire risk. And so we want, part of the management of or tool of using fire is actually to reduce future grassland fires and wildfires on the site. When we do prescribe fires, we, we set a prescribed burn plan in place uh, with very strict uh, prescriptions on how we design and conduct our burns. So we set a target area that we want to burn. We have specific management objectives on why we want to burn. And then within that burn, we have very uh, specific uh, climatic conditions that we can only burn in. So in our case for this burn today, uh, we set a maximum of 20 kilometer hour winds, a minimum of 20% relative humidity, and maximum of 20 degrees Celsius. So the way this weather has been this fall, we've never really hit those magic uh, numbers for conditions. And so we were able today on November the 3rd to tap into perfect weather conditions for a prescribed burn. Uh, the partnerships uh, here today, we have people from the University of Saskatchewan, we have people from Saskatchewan Parks, we've got people from the City of Saskatoon, and uh, we have other partners from other organizations that have come out to help us with this burn. Uh, our goal today is to try and burn up to uh, 22 acres of land uh, to help restore this site uh, to Native Prairie in the future. And uh, we would definitely would like to thank the Weston Family Foundation for their wonderful support and uh, for helping enhance grasslands across the prairie provinces and especially supporting the prescribed burning partnership that we're looking at developing across the three prairies. Uh, here in Saskatoon we've been using fire as a management tool at Miwasan and uh, in the University of Saskatchewan since the late 1980s and uh, that was really where this partnership has started from and we're looking to expand this to multiple agencies and organizations across the, uh, the prairies and including uh, producer groups and uh, landowners as well. So yeah and hope you enjoyed some of the shots of the prescribed burn today and some of the video and uh, we're going to keep on burning because we got no wind today and we want to take advantage of those ideal uh, weather conditions. So thanks everyone, enjoy the burn.